Hey filmmakers, Chongdi here. In this video, I'm releasing the seamless pin cushion transition, which works in combination with the seamless transition pack. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm releasing a video tutorial or a preset weekly, so subscribe and stay updated for more. For this seamless pin cushion transition, you do need to have the seamless transition pack. If you don't have it yet, go to the link in the description below and follow the links. If you already have the seamless transition pack, go to the link of the seamless pin cushion transition preset and you will land on this page. This is the most important section. Press one of these buttons in this section, like, share, tweet, follow me on Twitter. And once you have pressed one of these buttons, this section will disappear and a download link will appear. And if you appreciate what I do, there's also a donate button here below. Once you have downloaded the file, unzip it, go to your effects tab inside Premiere Pro, go to the preset bin, right mouse click on it, choose import preset and import this file. Once you have done that, inside of your seamless transition bin, you will find a new bin called Shongda Seamless Pin Cushion and there you will have the new preset. So now I'm going to show you how to apply this preset. So we're going to this part first. We're going to hold down shift and arrow three times to cut 15 frames here hold down command k to cut and yeah the same here shift up or shift down you can actually go faster to one of the ends of a clip now shift arrow three times also here and we're going to add the rolling i find the rolling looks the best and we're going to drop in the in here and the out here and here we have the rolling transition which looks nice and now from here we just select these both right mouse click and choose nest and now we can apply the pin in and out and actually let it load it a bit because it doesn't load it directly and here we now have the rolling with the pin cushion and if that works we can also hold down alt and drag this two times up and we can actually apply the rgb split so here the top middle and bottom let this load a little bit and actually I'm going to press enter to uh, pre-render because this is a quite heavy effect especially with the RGB split edit. Now that the rendering is finished we can see the result. So we have the rolling transition with also the RGB split. If you find that your computer is struggling with like these transitions you can also go to your sequence, right mouse click on it, choose sequence settings and here change the preview file format to GoPro Cineform and this uh, for me I find it works really well and also turn off composite in linear color as it requires uh, more GPU and also uh, makes it quite heavy so if you turn this off and change this it should help your computer to yeah use more uh, transitions and more of these heavier transitions so that was the seamless pin cushion transition for Premiere Pro. So I hope you guys like this video and please give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more upcoming videos, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Also check out my other videos on this channel because there's a lot of other presets, tutorials, reviews, previews and more. And if you have any questions, join us on Facebook. There's a link in the description below. And if you have any questions or stuff you want to discuss, comment below and I'll see you the next time. Bye bye.